Well, we're here on track at Wall Stadium for the fourth round of the Formula Drift Championship, and uh, we want to get some driver's insight. So I'm with the two Need for Speed drivers, Mr. Frederick Osbo, 2010 Formula Drift Rookie of the Year, and Mr. Matt Powers, Drift Party. We're going to get some insight in these high-horsepowered golf carts. And uh, let's let's run the track and, uh, and see basically at what point, what speed, what gear, and basically uh, underneath the helmet and uh, in your head. So let's go and hit it. Uh, push the right pedal there. That, that, that right pedal, that's the one there. So uh, if you guys want to break it down, Osbo, what do we got? First, second, uh huh. Wait for it. Uh huh. Third, third, and stay in third. Stay in third. At what point are you initiating now? I would say around here. Here, uh, short dab in the handbrake, meeting with the throttle throughout here, trying to adjust to that outer wall. Be real close. Maybe skim it a little bit. That's my goal, at least. Uh, yeah. Matt. Getting tight to the wall right now, getting sketched out. Oh, we're tapping the wall. Uh, ah, ah. Uh, right here, I'm just focusing on coming down and trying to have a clean transition coming off the bank. Because um, it's, otherwise it's super hard in your car. And just trying to mash it through here past the first clip. Boom, we came off of the wall into transition. This is a front clip. As we transition, we stay in the flat bottom. We're approaching another rear clipping zone, Osbo. Oh, yeah. And this is where, you know, transitions come into play. This is where you want to have a deep, badass, Committed, transition, uh -huh. meet on the throttle, stay on this white line right here, shoot out of it. Okay, now we're, we're coming out of this rear clipping zone. We're patching the uh, the midway point of what I like to call the figure eight. And uh, Powers, this is kind of, it looks deceiving because it looks flat, but right here, it's actually pretty pretty crazy, right? Coming through the center. Yeah, you just floor it through here and you just whoop, bump in. It's really oh. bumpy. Um, and I'm just worried about trying to make it out to this outer clip over here. I mean, I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's super bumpy. There's three whoops, and now this is another rear clipping zone. Kind of like turn two, except opposite. You want to come in here, commit it as well, stay on this line, although you want to exit fast so Chase Driver can't come up on your side. Now we're approaching the finish line. The judges want to see you smoke them all the way through. Nice and uh, carrying a lot of smoke through. And uh, was, that, was that a pretty good run there, Matt? Yeah, it's pretty good. Just upshift to third um, right there, back into third and floor it. And then what do you do once you cross the finish line? I slow down for the safety of everybody. That's so responsible. Frederick Osbo, more rock and roll. What do you do after you cross the finish line? Slow down for the responsibility of, and security <laughs> and safety for everybody. <laughs> safety first. You go off course, and then hopefully you get handed the win. That's a little bit of insight from the Team Need for Speed drivers, Mr. Matt Powers and Frederick Osbo.